Hey guys, Robert with the Piston Slap channel and I'm at Oahe Reservoir Dam. The Glory Hole. It's a beautiful ride up here. Uh, the, I'm pretty sure the Glory Hole is blocked off. <laughs> this sounds so dirty, but that's what they call it. So let's go take a peek at the Glory Hole, see if you guys can see it. If not, we will head uh, back down. So there's the glory hole. I don't know if you guys can see the up here <laughs> for obvious reasons you can either eat the mountain or fall into the reservoir and I don't want to do either I just want to I just want to make my YouTube video for you guys thing is guys on the way up here rough spot I was following a truck just enjoying the scenery and she's like get up here and that little lady gets out she goes you are one safe motorcycle rider wow that is uh that's a big reservoir take a quick look at it take a gander and on a map it uh, looks pretty decent Look at that. All really smoothed out. Strange that it would be smooth. <laughs> Tighter than the dam is. I guess maybe the wind and the dirt whipping through here just does that. So we are in Oregon, I believe Oahe County, just on the other side of the Idaho border. And uh, we're just checking things out. Actually, it's a part of the Idaho Adventure Motorcycle Club Challenge. I understand this is an adventure bike, but it's what I've got, and I do have adventures on it. Obviously, I'm not doing the sport bike thing, you know, up there ripping around Loman Loop or whatever it is, or speeding up to Idaho City. Uh, yeah, man, get on your side of the road. But, you know, to each his own, you know, I enjoy it. But there's just so many uh, people going to Idaho City causing the, the fuzz, the popo, the 5-0, all those guys to just, you know, they're up there watching that road now. And I even heard rumor that uh, if the citizens catch you on video and can prove it was you doing something stupid, um, then, you know, the cops pull you over, the citizen shows up, shows the cop the video, and that is that. So it ain't worth it. That was gonna be slick. Let's grab a, a gear for moving <laughs> when you come to a stop. Too much time on the DRZ, honestly, guys. This, we can never have too much time on the DRZ. What am I saying? That DRZ loves it, and I love it. <laughs> you know, and the sad thing, guys, is I invited all my friends to come out and ride this with me. Nobody, and I shouldn't say all my friends because there's a bunch of my friends that watch my videos that I didn't talk to today. But you know, the group that I was riding with, because I did the uh, Idaho Adventure, or Idaho, I keep saying that, um, I did the uh, ride uh, demo days or something for Indian for that, and I rode a couple Harleys for the first time ever, and I'm, I'm 
get, you know, those of you that have Harleys, you know, that's your thing. Um, me personally, I, I don't think I'd ever own one. I wasn't really thrilled with the two that I did ride, or three. I don't know. Anyway, um, one sounded like it was coming apart, and I asked the guy about it, and he goes, oh, yeah, that's normal. It's, that's a design noise into it. Uh, to me, it sounds like the wrist pin's got a crack in the piston area. And the guy was like, oh, you know, this is normal. <laughs> Not in my book. I ain't parking that in my garage. Normal. <laughs> right. Whatever. So, guys, if we were on the DRZ, I have this uh, thing that I would uh, probably go that way. Since I'm not on the DRZ, I'm on something with slicks. We're gonna stick to the, the paved surfaces. And we must be getting near the end. The boat ramp, boat launching campground. We'll take the campground because we don't have any boats to launch. It's a motor boat. Mm -hmm. That is the end of the trip, guys. That is Indian Creek Campground and a porta potty. We're not going to either, so we'll uh, flip you guys back on when we get to the other side of the dam. Behold, a rabbit in the wild. I'm surprised I can get so close to him without him running off. probably going to attack me viciously or he's wounded and hurt. So guys, you'd do it <laughs> if you were here. Bike still handles the same, other than I can't accelerate through the corner. The brakes are so noisy. Like right there. Well, there was. It's underwater and all tore up. Stuff like that. I think I posted a picture of it uh, a few months ago or a month ago on my Instagram account that said, bridge out or something similar like that. So, uh, if you guys are on my Instagram feed, you can just kind of dig through there if you want to see it. I don't really want to stop and look at it. I know it sounds silly because I've got a video, but reality I've already looked at it and the water's up higher so I can't really get out to the bridge where I was before. So let's just enjoy the canyon views, the twisty roads. They're not the smoothest roads in the world but they're better than uh, better than some of the roads I've been on this uh, spring. I'll tell you that.
pretty much it for the canyon. It kind of just goes down here two, three more turns and opens up into farmland or whatever it is they call it out here. Um, I want to say thanks a lot for joining me on this Oahe Dam Reservoir. I don't, I don't know what you want to call it, an adventure or what. It's an adventure for me. I got out. I went somewhere. I've, not, I've been here once, just kind of pre-running to make sure you know this was something that Green Bike could do. Uh, but all jib jab aside, I want to say thank you again for tuning in. I'm Robert with the Piston Slap Channel. See you guys next week.